Ah, young lady. I wanted to see you off. But you know hmm. something you wanted to ask? Fortunately, Svarog turned out to have some useful information for you. After all your hard work, I'd feel quite guilty. Well, you still have a long journey ahead. I have no doubt our paths will cross again one day. Well, my friends, are you ready? Wonderful! Remember to bring enough food and drink. I've returned. Rania, I thought... I thought I'd lost you. Where were you? Are, are you hurt? I'll fetch the butler right away. No, there's no need. I don't want to... I'm fine, really. I just got into a few skirmishes down in the underworld. The underworld? In that case, report everything you saw. Commander, Rania. After the failed pursuit at Backwater Pass, the Wanted Outsiders and I were somehow taken to the... Because of the difficult situation we were in, we formed a... Temporary Alliance. To help the... We also defeated an ancient robot known as Svarog, and learned some truths. I'm listening. Go on. Madam Kakolia. It is my firm belief that the visitors from beyond the sky are not the villains we... I witnessed them take up arms in the name of justice, and risk their lives for the sake of others. I... Mother... You've always known the truth about the Stellaron, haven't you? Well, the responsibility of bearing that... So, I ask you to forgive my defiance, but... I believe that the order to dispatch the Outsiders was a mistake. To solve the problems brought on by the Stellaron, the Architects waited hundreds of years. And those Outsiders may be the... Enough! Ignorant! Oh, you disappoint me, Bronya. You merely glimpsed the tip of the iceberg, and now you think you know everything. Guards! They are not my entire life. Everything you ever kept from me. I remember it clearly now. Tell me what you have seen. What exactly it is you are hiding. Why do you send the Silvermane guards to die in the fragment? <sighs> I knew this moment would come sooner or later, I just... You want to know why I gave those orders? Yes. Then come with me, Bron. It is time you heard it. The voice of this dying world. Unreliable Sampo. He probably guessed we'd ask. No way! The boss will recognize us. Plus, Silvermane guards are stationed near Don Hung. What do you I think it'd be best to pay a visit to Serval. So, you think we should avoid Jip? He's an elite officer of the Silvermane guards. It wouldn't be easy to get to him. Mm, makes sense. But. We What's wrong, Z? Nothing. It's. The last time I was on the surface, I was still a child. The overworld. I'm okay. Let's go. There are so many Silvermane guards on patrol. Is it usually like this? No. I don't remember the security being this tight. The Supreme Guardian has probably learned of our arrival already. Branya. Alright, you'll be safe here. My workshop has pretty good- Just what crime did you commit, exactly? They recalled a bunch of guards from- Oh, 
we just- Not yet, March. Rania said we could trust you completely. You mean to say you don't trust me completely? Good. That's smart of you. But you needn't worry. Kokolia and I aren't even on speaking terms. It was her that ejected- I don't believe you guys would do anything bad. And the architects are gonna need conclusive and publicly available evidence for me to think otherwise. I know Kokolia's style. Get everyone into a frenzy first. Most people in a frenzy don't stop to ponder the details. <laughs> you could say that. We were like sisters once. These days, I just spend my time fixing things in this workshop. If I'm not careful, I'll start boring you all with sob stories from the past. Let's get back to you guys. You can trust me. I know our paths have only crossed once before, but my intuition tells me you guys are... Ooh, I'm the best storyteller! <clears throat> Perhaps I should do it. So that's what's been happening. No wonder we hadn't heard from Branya recently. I believe you. There's no way you could have invented all those twists and turns. What's more, we have Miss Zila here as living proof. As for the Stellaron, when I was still one of the architects working in the scientific research division, I never thought I'd hear that word again after being expelled by the architects. Only a very few people in Bellabog know of the existence of the Stellaron. But according to the data recorded in that robot, Svarag, the architects dug out the truth long ago. Just my luck. Out of all the research topics I could have chosen, I insisted on the Stellaron! Maybe I should be thanking Kakolia. All she did was push me out. She could... I figured out that the Stellaron and the Fragmentum were linked, so I was already close to the truth. It's a shame that the architect, before I lost my position, I was applying for permission to survey the Stellaron directly. It was my research topic, but I'd never even set eyes on it. My research was all bathed not long after I submitted my preliminary report and application. Kokolia. It's been so- She became a completely different person when she took on the Supreme Guardianship. She gave the order to expel me herself and refused to see me. Sometimes I even wonder whether she really did become a different person. Is she being compelled by previous generations of guardians to make such- Yes. I never observed it directly, but I use... According to the survey results, the Stellaron is likely to the north of Bellabog. We must locate it as soon as possible. Ideally before Kokolia takes action. Can you... Not a problem. I was thinking the same thing. The area to the north of Bellabog has been more or less swallowed up, but even if you get past the restricted zone in one piece... Correct. And it's different from the underground towns you described. It sounds like... The three of us and Zila might not be enough. I fear we may not have- Hey! Enough pessimism. Back in my official- This calls for brainwaves, not brawn- Really? Great! Phew. <laughs> I want to see the Stellaron too, you know. It was my research topic for over a- That's settled then. There's no time to lose. We should head out- I forgot. Find somewhere to hide. Quick! I'll handle him. Japard! It's you! I didn't think you'd have the time to visit with things so... Things are manageable. The latest wave of monster attacks has slowed. I'm back in the city- Ah! Oh. Yeah. Sis, you look a bit- N no Why would anything have happened? You don't normally use my full name. Uh... You said you hate it when I call you bro in public. Well, 
I agree. You can call me whatever you like. Look, Serval, I'm here on official business today. There's... Those guys can't think outside the box. Of course they can't wrap their heads around my... Dis Sorry to trouble you. Why are you being so polite? Oh, and... I... I've been in... Lil Jeppy. So grown up. Don't say that. Ah, forget it. If I don't... Last night, Lady Bronya suddenly appeared. The Supreme Guardian is worried that the three intruders may have followed Bronya out of the Fragmentum and back into the Administrative District. Ah, so that's how it is. I'm not sure. She hasn't left Klopoth Fort. The Supreme Guardian just said she'd returned. <laughs> well, I was sure worried about her. After she disappeared, Pela's workload doubled. She said she barely had time to go out. She really does tell you everything. Oh, by the way, I left my Goethe Hotel limited edition flask behind last time I was here. Let me have a look for- uh, Wait! Mm, what is it? It's, um... Right! You remember how you neglected all those flowers to death? Seems like a strange reason not to take a look. Plus, am I supposed to- uh not? How Never mind. This is your space, and I shouldn't intrude. Uh, hey, wait a sec. Uh, those intruders. They're plotting to overthrow the architects. Huh. Reminds me of the accusations against me. Don't say that, Serval. I know that you're still- You're telling me off again? Fine. I will, if I have the time. The coast is clear. You can come out now. <sighs> you... I... I almost lost my cool when he went for his flask. This is bad. Bronya's in... Attempting to storm Klopoth Fort by ourselves? Forget it, Zila. I don't care how skilled... Rest assured, Kokolia may have changed over the years. <sighs> you sound like Bronya herself. I don't get... I was gauging his reactions just now. Did you see? Unless we have irrefutable evidence, he won't question Kokolia's order. Come on, let's go to the restricted zone. If we can get ahead of the curve... Is Bronya really safe? You care about her, huh? You must have become close friends. Uh, oh, they've jacked up security, all right. How the heck are we gonna stay? Leave it to me. This is a military base. Trust me, isn't that? Serval well, if it isn't Franz. Well, you see, I... yeah, you. So, what brings you over here at this hour? My brother said the restricted zone energy lines were malfunctioning. Told me it was urgent. He doesn't trust those. These guys are my assistants. We need to overhaul all the install. Uh, I didn't hear anything about the energy. Li oh, please. This is a technology division issue. Why would they tell you guys? Come on. N no, that's uh. Seeing as your Captain Japard's sis. Okay. Here are some temporary passes. Thanks, Franz. I'll put in a good word for you with my brother and get him to- No, no. Captain Japard hates all that under-the-table stuff. I'd have a better chance if you don't mention me at all. See? That was easy. You're- Hard sister, all right. I don't want people to see. Do you see that mechanical gear bridge? When you cross over to the other. An endless fragmentum? A few exhausted so If we want to progress further north. Exactly. 
Let's go then. I help set the underlying mechanisms for this type of gear bridge. Is Japard on frontline duty a lot? Yes, but what made you ask that all of a sudden? It's so dangerous. Don't you worry about him? <sighs> nope. This terminal's offline. So what's the plan? Look for another. Every plot- I never would have guessed that Japard and you were brother and sister. I can't say I blame you. We're nothing alike in personality or interests. In our family, we have a strong military tradition going back generations. Many a- Darn! Can't activate it. It seems like someone's severed the- I-, I... With the front line on high alert, they must have rotated the bridge to make it impassable. Then they cut up- That way, even if the front line were to collapse, the fragment- <sighs> Branya was right. The silver main go Just my conjecture, but I doubt it's far from the truth. Let's press on. We can't activate either of these terminals, so let's look for the- shaped like a giant and it's behind a gate its formal name is the mechanism energy hub it's connected to all the energy mm. one unit for everything as long as we can gain access permission that's why i told them we were here for urgent maintenance the frontline equipment needs sir so that's why you come on let's see if that guard over there will let us pass Are you the emergency engineers? I saw- Not yet. Everything looks normal so far. If you let us in, we can do a routine service inspection. <laughs> no, 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 no. No can do. Uh, not even the Supreme- The Supreme Guardian? Hey, no games, you hear? Ah, uh, darn, this guy- You need the encryption key, right? Uh, uh, Captain Dunn's resting up ahead. Go and find him. Dunn? Why didn't you see? Serval, this Dunn, do you know him? You bet I do. We go way back. He's easy to talk to. Watch me persuade him. Hey, Dunn! It's been a while. I didn't know you made security, Captain. S Serval, it's been a long time. You're Allow me to introduce my assistants to you. They help me take care of business at the workshop. Everyone, this is Captain Dunn, an old friend of mine. He used to be an ace on the keys in the- Oh, you play rock and roll- Pleased to meet you. Oh, <clears throat> hello. <laughs> oh, what's that weird- <clears throat> uh, Zachary! How many days has it been since you showered? Uh, I showered right before my shift. Hmm? What did you say? I... I haven't showered in two days, sir. Unacceptable! Especially in front of visitors. Apologies for the embarrassment. <laughs> it's not a big deal, Dunn. Uh, you know, if you get it, my keyboard guy is pretty good, but I still miss our military days playing in the band. <laughs> that was a long time ago, Serval. I haven't touched a keyboard in ages. Besides, I'm stationed here all year round. I'm afraid I don't get many chances to return to the city. Though I don't stand on ceremony. Uh, how may I assist you? If everything's in order, you'd better head back to this- I've checked the lines. There don't seem to be any major problems. All that's left is- The guard over there said that I needed an encryption key to- <sighs> Anything wrong? Uh, sorry, Serval, but can you tell me what kept? Huh? Oh, uh, let me think. 
Hey, sis, the energy supply lines in the restricted zone have malfunctioned. Those useless engineers can't find the problem. And may I ask, when did- Uh, this morning? Yeah, that's right. He's on urban patrol duty today, right? Aha. Uh -huh. Captain Jappard just returned to the front line. Huh? Uh, hold up, he's back? <sighs> you haven't changed, Serval. These people you've brought, they're... They're not works. Uh, Serval, it's not that I don't want to help you. But you should remember that I'm a bell of... How about this? You can leave, and I won't tell anyone about this incident. There goes the negotiate. brought you guys here, and I'm standing with you to- Done, this concerns the fate of Bellabog. No, the fate of our whole world- Serval! We used to rehearse together every day, you must- My rock and roll soul is to uphold the dignity of a soldier. Move carefully. Customers are always welcome. Evil has begun. Yes! yes! Oh. Looks like somebody needs a doctor. Huh? Stay close. Not a step back. Clemency? Take Never this. heard of it. Shape of Taishu! Rise, Phoenix! It's too late to repent. The truth of life and death, revealed in an in this sanctuary, is but a vision! I'll go through you, huh? Let's be friends, shall we? Chill out! Serval? What? I'm sorry, Dunn. Time for a little nap. <laughs> He's just unconscious. <laughs> Stubborn fool. Strong. Got it! The encryption key! Quick, before we attract attention, let's... I think we attracted attention! That's the enemy attack alarm. Every Silvermane guard in the reserve zone just... We've made it up till now. I could lose an arm and a leg for all I care. Quick, back to the energy supply hub. Anyone that... If I'd known he had the encryption key from the start, I could have snuck in and taken it off him myself. Shoulda, coulda, woulda, Sila. Activating the gear bridge. Al Who Someone goes there? there? Who goes there? I see. See. Listen, feel kick! 
this sanctuary is but a vision. But a vision! Get it now? That's the power of the Cloud Knights. We're in. It's open! Oh. Give me some time. Who designed this operating system? It's so unintuitive. Emergency fire evacuation system. Rock and roll dance floor atmosphere mode. Who the heck added that? Your bridge control terminal. <laughs> Still found it. That's it. I've reset the energy system. Let's go and operate the gear bridge. Um, Sir Vol, won't more Silver Main guards be waiting for us on the other side of the gear bridge? Yep. Then what's our plan? Well, either we reason with them or charge straight through the blockade. Let's play it by ear. Uh... Careful. There's a big guy up ahead. There's no other way. We'll have to fight. <laughs> if we can beat Svarog...
Move carefully. Let's be friends, shall we? Evils be gone. Let me through, or I'll go through you. Yes! Take this! Shape of Tyson Rise Phoenix! Hey <laughs> Wanna see what I can do? You're not going anywhere! Step aside. I have no interest in stoking conflict. Customers are always welcome. Yeah. Looks like somebody needs a doctor. Look, listen, feel, kick! Shall we? The truth of life and death, revealed in an instant. This sanctuary is but a vision. Customers are always welcome. <laughs> yeah. Let me through, or I'll go a through you. Wonders to raise your spirits. Good omens. Wanna see what I can do? Yes! yes! <laughs> Time to show you! What's in your prescription? Hey! Shall we? This shape of Tai rise, Phoenix. <laughs> Chill out. Energy restored. System online. Percent. Sixty-five percent. We did it. We've gained access to the gear. Perfect. Okay. We need to get to the front line. We could have a problem. He probably is. Hopefully we don't bump into him. Are you sure you can convince- I've probably got a- <sighs> Meaning it could end. Haven't you noticed yet? Most of our convincing and- We need to be sure, Saval. If we can't reach a common understanding with your brother- Of course. My word is my bond. I said that I'd stand with- Before our next expedition, I need Himeko to teach me some negotiation skills. 
beating people up all the time is cramping my elegance. <laughs> I haven't fought with Jappard since he enlisted. He could never beat me when we were little, but now... Serval. It really is you. Wait, Jappard. Listen to me. When the sentry reported to me, I thought there must have been a misunderstanding. The enemy alarm. Step away from the intruder, Serval. Walk over slowly and stand behind me. You're different from them. I'm sorry. We have an understanding. <sighs> Give me a few minutes, just a few. Enough, Serval. <gasps> have you forgotten where we are? We Landau's ought to know this place better than anywhere. The outer reaches of the front line against every silver main guard here. Every person here is ready to sacrifice themselves. Yet here you are, leading fugitives into the restricted zone. Attacking my silver main comrades in arms. Hijacking the energy hub. Why do you think I've come here? We found a way to dispel the eternal freeze, to seal the fragmentum. If that were true, why wouldn't you report to Madame Kakoli? You don't understand. The one preventing us from getting close to the truth? You have all seen the Supreme Guardian in person. Do you think you can a Listen to me, Jepard! The origin and spread of the Fragmentum is linked to the Stellaron. The I know about the Stellaron. It's exactly what the fugitives behind you are seeking. But the Madame Guardian has already- The Madame Guardian has warned me before that you were indulging in fantasy. That you'd been exposed to forbidden knowledge. And that you would- Guards! Formation! Arrest these people. We could be inundated with fragments. The forbidden is only forbidden to conceal the truth within. Kokoli is afraid that we'll seize on this knowledge. That the truth will spread far and wide. To save the world we m I've said my piece. Whether you believe it or not is up to you. Regardless, you should know by now your sister's never been one to back down. If there's something or someone you can't abide, you should stand up and resist. And if there's something you uphold, you should uphold it to the very end! Save your explanation for the judge! You are charged with sabotaging the Silver Main Guard Restricted Zone. This isn't like our childhood game, Serval. The barrier hasn't been fixed yet. Don't try and be a hero, Jepard! Uh, didn't I tell you? All our negotiations end in combat! Resistance is futile! Move? The truth of life and death revealed in this sanctuary is but a vision. Want to see what I can do? Yes. Looks like somebody needs a doctor. Stay focused. Take courage. Don't you be hurt. Gotta get those vitamins! 
step aside. I have no interest in stoking conflict. Life and death, revealed in an instant. This sanctuary is but a vision! Customers are always welcome. Take this! Shape of Taishu! Rise, Phoenix! Chill out! No more playing nice. Dodge this! Be tend to your wounds. Look, listen, feel, kick. <laughs> Let's be friends, shall we? Yeah. Looks like somebody needs a book. Yeah. Oh, never. He just won't go down. He's as stubborn as I am. It could be an argument or a fight. He'll do both to the death. That's enough, Jepard. Take a look around you. You're the last man standing. Even if I am, I won't yield. We don't want you to yield through force of arms. That wouldn't be a victory for- Yeah! Our goal is the same as yours! Sir Val's and Branya's! We just want to preserve this world! They're- Jepard! Brother! Surely now you can see the need for pra- Even if you don't believe my outsider friends, you should believe me! Maybe I've wasted your trust. In which case, believe Branya! Lady Bron- There's nothing more to say, Jepard. As a captain of the Silver Mane Guards, I am duty bound to carry out the. But, Lady Bronya is the commanding officer for the front lines. According to military protocol, if the front. For the Silvermane Guards, the Guardian's orders are paramount and absolute. But there is... The people of Belabog. If we lose the people, we lose the reason for our existence. Our fight with the Fragmentum Monsters is for the sake of preservation. If you are truly able to prevent our endlessly unfolding misfortunes, then the people of Belabog are indebted to you. But if you are using lies to mask your true intentions, Using my sister and Branya for your own- You're not lying. I promise you. You must be Zila. You are a skilled fighter. Your combat's- Regardless of what you believe, these guys have been a great help to the underworld. Hmm. If you want to advance further northward, you must traverse an area entirely corroded by the Fragmentum. The guards can give you some time before the next wave of attacks is upon us. As soon as the restricted zone gate is open, the monsters on the other side will turn out in full force. 
the guards will do their best to stall them and buy you some time. Once you've broken through the front line, there's nothing more we can do for you. So, have you made up your minds? Understood. Keep your weapons close. This Guards, open the gate. Are you dealing with attacks like this every day? It's a common occurrence. Guards, formation! <laughs> well, I'm gonna make sure I don't owe the guard. Here they come! Steal yourselves! I'll go through you! Dodge this! <laughs> Look, listen, feel, kick! Uh. You're not going anywhere! Step aside. I have Take no interest this. in stoking cotton. Shape of Tyson Rise Phoenix! <laughs> Wanna see what I can do? <laughs> Clemency? Never heard of it. Customers are always welcome. The truth of life and death, revealed at this sanctuary, is but a vision! Let's be friends, shall we? Yeah. <laughs> Gotta get those vitamins! <sighs> Better late than never! Through, or I'll go through you. Huh? Step aside. I have no interest in stoking cotton. How many of them are there? The more, the merrier. These guys are nothing. Hold the line. <laughs> Never heard of it. A thousand wonders to raise your spirit. Good omens. Fight us one! Step aside. I have no interest in stoking conflict. <laughs> Wanna see what I can do? Dodge this! <laughs> Told you, Jepard, the barrier hasn't been fixed yet. This is only the first wave. They'll have reassembled soon. I have to. Hey, Mr. Silvermane, listen to your sister. <sighs> Outsiders, Zila, the second wave hasn't started yet. Make the most of this opportunity and make a break for. Huh, uh, Sir Ball, aren't you gonna? My brother can't hold them back by himself. He wasted a lot of energy on us. He's my responsibility now. Besides, if I'm not here to help, I don't know what might happen in the next wave. I want to go with you. I do. I always wanted to catch a glimpse of the Stellaron with my own eyes, and now it's so close. But I can't abandon my brother and the other guards. I'm a Landau. It's up to you now. I believe in you. 
You've given me new hope. Get hold of the Stellaron before Kakolia realizes what's happening. Hey, March. Don't forget to take a picture of the Stellaron for me. Say no more! We're good at this! Fragmentum activity is intensifying. Something's happening on Eurelo 6. Shouldn't we go down there, Himiko? <laughs> Have faith in them. Besides, this is her first trailblazing expedition. Are you bored, Welt? I understand. But we have lots of opportunities ahead of us. Let's... Mm. So you think they'll be safe? Yes. We haven't seen any Eon or Emanator level in that. This is a young person's adventure. We shouldn't interfere. Is this... the Fragmentum, Japart? Compared to this, the corrosion we saw in Backwater Pass pales into insignificance. Serval said that the Stellaron was very likely hidden in the snow plains north of Bellabog. If we want to get the- Guys, does this place feel weird to you? <laughs> this place makes my- We have no guide and no way of detecting the Stellaron. Well, just don't be disheartened. The stronger the fragmentum contamination, the closer we. Oh, look! Up ahead on the ground! What is that? This is. Run? Yeah, so she's. She's. Whoa! <laughs> That's Branya! Huh? Is that Kakolia too? No. It isn't them. It must be... a kind of echo? Which means they were definitely here, and it looks like they went back- <laughs> Just in time. We had no idea which direction to take. haven't told me what this place is, Mother. Seven hundred years ago, this was Bellabog's northern border, and the site of an ancient battle. Now, it is nothing more than... Don't let its fragmented appearance fool you, Branya. On the day the promise is fulfilled, these ruins will be... Oh, Mother, do you truly believe the Stellaron's promise? It summoned the blizzard beyond our walls and... And yet... The crime of our ancestors was there. What? From the moment those intruders descended from beyond the sky, this world was... There is a price to pay for new life, wiping away every decaying vestige of the old world. When the promise is fulfilled, Branya, no longer will we have to... No. This is a complex mechanism. <sighs> I knew this wouldn't be simple. Uh, wait, wasn't there some big energy hub looking thing back in that end? <sighs> I can't say I like the idea of interacting with our surroundings, especially this deep into the fragmentum. However. However. There's no other way. Desperate times call for desperate measures. It worked, right? But the gate didn't move in it. Are there other... Hmm. It's clear that whoever designed these mechanisms did... Look, over there! I think I can see the next... Oh, I see it too. Now. 
Get it now? That's the power of the Cloud Knight. But a vision! Monsters would usually destroy man made objects. Did you hear that? This mechanism must be on now. Come on, let's find the next one. Where is the next mechanism? There's no switch. I've never seen such a desolate place. At least in Rivet Town, you could tell that people used to live there. Rivet Town is only at the outstretched fingertips of the corrosion. Now. I want to ask you a question. Do you still remember those dreams you mentioned? I know you're wide awake right now, but I need you to try. Well, this is merely speculation, but perhaps the, the one in your body resonating with the Stellaron. Huh? You mean that 
Stellarons can communicate? Well, there's never been a human that could accommodate. Then... Yes. Don Hung's speculations are usually right on the money. But even if we've... <laughs> There's no way back anyway. At least Kokolia won't... I have to save Branya. Beat Kokolia and... A vision. All the best. Good omens. Fight us one. Yes. to Branya. Let's move! Uh, are these echoes too? Yes. The fragmentum here seems to have made a special... I don't understand. Even if the truth is as you see, and all of them... Do you still not see, Branya? There is no right or... Our ancestors including Elisa Rand, spent their whole lives trying- They spent lifetimes writing songs to those entities of greater magnificence in the heavens. I shall not follow the Guardian's misguided- But clip off the preservation. Are they not one of the magnificent and- The preservation. Has the preservation ever looked humanity in the eye? Oh, you will hear the real voice of magnificence. Check this place out! Tables and sentry posts? They're... Looks like another complete- Considering where we are? I don't care how strange it is. Inviting you. Who's 
the lucky one today! Go through you. Hey, you don't look so good. Look, listen, feel. Good. A thousand wonders to raise your spirit. Good omens. Fight us. Want to see what I can do? Dodge this! I've lost my way. Take this! Shape of Tysh! Rise, Phoenix! Let's be friends, shall we? Chill out! Different. If I didn't know it was a product of the fra- Unlike those random low-level fragmentum creations. Look, Branya and Kokolia's echoes. They must have come- uh. I sense that we're very near to the Northern Snope. This is where the First Guardian led the Silvermane Guards into battle. But the otherworldly Legion did not tire. She soon realized that flesh and blood could not contend with so ruthless an enemy. When all was nearly lost, she chose to set her sights on the stars. As for what came later... So... The Eat... <laughs> Ironic, no? <laughs> All the Stellaron did was answer humanity's... Even going so far as to attempt to use it. It? Oh, something created using otherworldly technology. An inhibitor that a corporation from the old world in the arc... Oh, I know you have many questions, my daughter. Shadow of hers again. But Branya's isn't. It feels like this echo is different. Intruders! Uh, did. did she. You cannot! Not good. The Stellaron! The intruders! Oh, you go no further. Uh, are you sure this isn't the real her? It may look like her, but the fragmentum of the forgeries 
Bring her down! The truth of life and death, revealed in this sanctuary, is but a vision! Customers are always welcome! All the best! Clemency? Never heard of it. Let's be friends, shall we? Chill out! Tremble before my power! Can we talk? Dodge this! Look, listen, feel, kick! Step aside. I have no interest in still. Freeze to death! Witness the avalanche! Customers are always welcome. Or I'll go through you! You're not going anywhere! Stay off! <sighs> Better late than never! Sinners, ready yourself for the judgment of eternal winter! <laughs> Time to show you! Never heard of it. This sanctuary is but a vision. Gotta get those vitamins. Don't worry about me. Let's be friends, shall we? Chill out. Don't your hands hurt. Let me through, or I'll go through you! Dodge this! Take this! Shape of Tuck Rise Phoenix! Step aside. I have no in the times now. <laughs> Be tend to your wounds, huh? Tremble before my power. Devoured by ice. The eternal freeze will bury you. Look, listen, feel, kick! The truth of life and death, revealed in this sanctuary, is but a vision! Sinners, ready yourself for the judgment of eternal winter! <laughs> Time to 
time to show you. What's in your prescription? You're the best. Customers are always welcome. All the best. <laughs> Wanna see what I can do? Dodge this! Take this! Shape of the Rise Phoenix! You know that they promised. way forward. Wherever they lead, it must be the end of the journey. I don't want to get to the end so soon. I want my journey to go on for- This means that Branya is up ahead. And so is the fate of the overworld and the- <laughs> Strange. I thought I'd feel nervous or afraid. The Express has traveled world after world. We are merely passing. We invariably avoid getting drawn into turbulence that- Or to put it another way, this is- I was about to bore you all with my gloomy reflections, but on second thought, not- to Right on! But you can say whatever you like. Helping those in need, befriending those worth counting on, and saving the world a few times along the way. Here. The blizzard's so fierce. Now the power from the trailblaze path isn't enough to stop the cold. It means that we're getting closer to the Stellaron and the heart of the Eternal Freeze. different from the uniform style of the buildings we saw in the city. Does it look like the palm of a huge hand to you? If Kakolia threatens us by taking Branya hostage... We have to save her. The underworld... No. The entire planet relies on her. Resist, Branya. Accept the common will. No! I... I don't want this. Look upon their promised future, Branya! A world without poverty, without cold, without suffering. A world where people no longer have to pray like prisoners for survival. 700 years ago, we tried and fought unceasingly. Believing that the radiance of human nature could shepherd us towards rejuvenation. <laughs> and why, when faced with irrefutable strength, is our first thought always to resist? To cover our ears instead of 
hearing the call. It is the conceit and cowardice entrenched in the depths of human nature. So difficult to efface. Cast them aside. Break free of the chains that bind you. The Stellaron will lead humanity to evolve. Your brainwashing ends here, you witch! Zila? You came. I thought the blizzards had entombed you. You wish! We're not going down before Yranya! I don't know what happened between you and them. Even if you explained it to me, I probably wouldn't understand all the crazy details. One, these guys have come through hell to get here, to seal this Stellaron thing. And two, do you remember what I said? If anything happened to you, I... Do you understand? Even if the damage is done, even if you've completely forgotten our promise, then, then I'm just gonna have to knock you out and bring you back myself! Zila, all of you. <laughs> Finished? I think I've given you long enough to bid farewell. It's time I told you my other reason for bringing you here. I want to witness your choice. I have told you all the truths there are to tell. The deal with the Stellaron, the wish I made to it. Many years ago, the voice of the Stellaron sounded in my ears for the first time. I was no different from the previous generations of Guardians. I withdrew, where my conviction was once steadfast, unparalleled. Until a sudden change arrived and threw everything into chaos. Another choice appeared before me. A subversion of the old order. And compared to the illusory, ever more distant preservation, this... I have agonized, long agonized, over how to convey all this to you. Inevitably, the promise tomorrow will transpire, and I would descend into torment. <laughs> Perhaps I should be thanking you, outsiders. The pressure you have imposed has it on you. Throughout your life, I have never forced you to submit to my will. You have always, will always have a choice. Choose. <clears throat> Madame Kokolia, I am grateful to you for raising me and for allowing me the privilege of but I, I am sorry, Mother. On this, our final occasion, hmm. you say that conceit and cowardice lie in the depths of human nature. <laughs> Perhaps you're right. Desperation sheds light on the darkest recesses of the heart. What about those simply struggling for survival, fighting for something better? I've witnessed their light on the front lines, in the underworld, in places you have overlooked. Our ancestors built this city, striving in the bitter snow to prolong our civilization. Even if this world is doomed to fall apart, not hand over our fate to the seed of ruin. Guardian's mother, chosen from among the masses. Our duty is to preserve the world built by humanity. We are you seek to crush human nature underfoot while masquerading as an as an arbiter and a god. I cannot let you. So this is your choice. I understand, Branya. Pity. Such a pity that you will never see that resplendent world. Unable to free yourself from the shackles of your mind. The ground! It's shaking! What's happening? That sign! The fate of this city, of Bellabog, is sealed. Its future will unfold in our hands.
and you will become the foundation of the new world! You must break the old to build the new. The Supreme Guardian commands you! Rise, Engine of Creation! It's one of the Earth that has ancient machines! Watch out, all of you! Let's make it quick. Let me tend to your wounds! Stay off! Much better. to be broken.
Look, listen, feel, kick! Customers are always welcome. <laughs> Wanna see what I can do? Let's be friends, shall we? is the only hope for this world. Just as it dispelled the Antimatter Legion 700 years ago, so too will it wipe you from the face of this world! Stay alert. Just a scratch. Rules are made to be broken. Welcome! Let's make it quick. Let's go. Take this! <laughs> Humanity. So weak and foolish. Always overestimating their abilities. Let me bestow upon you despair! Kakolia, why am I here? The last time I came here, I drew Nanook's gaze. Could it... The commercial district has fallen. We've transferred the residents to the outer municipal district for the time being. 
The garrison lost 26 fighters. But I... Go on, Jepard. I... I'm not sure that they're dead. I saw their broken figures lingering in the fragmentum. What happened back there defied all reason. It was madness. Madam Guardian, if this continues... I know well the consequences, Jepard. You may leave. For? Get out of this cage and take a look at the city. What is there to lose? The efforts of our predecessors, their unfinished research. We can finally see them come to fruition. Give me some soldiers and I'll locate the Stellaron and find out how to save our world. You need to come to your senses, Serval. Come? Sis? What are you? Guards! Miss Serval is tired. Take her to rest. Sequester her lab and detain the researchers. Their work is illegal. Why, Kakalia? Why have you grown so cold? Serval Landau. You were my most cherished friend. Madam Kakolia, the monsters are surging this way. It's too dangerous here. to the underworld. How will those below ground fend for themselves if we withdraw every guard? The automatons will ensure their safety. The most important defensive position is here on the surface. If our lines crumble, the underground will vanish in an instant. Our defenses here must be maintained at all costs. These are the choices we make, Branya. As a leader, you must harbor the courage and foresight to choose. You, me, and every Silver Main Guard in the city, all of us must carry out a higher mission. There will come a day when you must make your own choice. Do you understand? A higher mission? <laughs> it is too early, Branya. Still too early. You will understand when the time is right. The city is drowning in tears. The power of the preservation is fading. We could not defy the will of the Stellaron after all. Yes, but we have no right to. 
to judge. The Fragmentum had been expanding for the past 700 years. There is no faith nor wealth left for our successors. Oh, to see the home we vowed to preserve wither away. That in itself is torture. Not to mention the haunting whisper of temptation. The day will come when even the strongest of wills cannot help but give in to such influence.
be friends, shall we? Lance ablaze! Flaming Lance! Forward! Customers are always welcome. Evil has begun. <laughs> Wonders to raise your spirit. Good omens. I just won. Want to see what I can do? Yes. Dance up Take the rest. This shape of tuck fries. I'm on guard. Pressure! <clears throat> Let me through it. <clears throat> no more playing nice. <clears throat> Let's be friends, shall we? All the best! Stellaron changes everything! Look, listen, feel, kick! <laughs> Wanna see what I can do? Watch this! <laughs> Lance up the ready. Defend the weak. Ready to be crushed. Lance ablaze. Flaming lance. Forward. Answer. Shoot! 
Tough trailblazing expedition. We made it! But. Uh, I've informed Himiko and Mr. Yang already. They'll seal the Stellaron. Nice! The crisis on this world is big. Mm. Huh. Now that the Stellaron is sealed, the Eternal Freeze will slowly recede. The fragmentum won't aggressively expand. It will depend on the efforts of the people. Thank you. Thank you. There is still much to do. The people will have felt the effects of the engine of creation. There are so many questions to answer, so many truths to reveal. I don't know whether I can get the people to accept all this. Really do that? Tell everyone about Mother's true motives? But no. No. Tila, I... I don't know how to explain it in the underworld. We tell the kids, things will be better tomorrow. How can you imagine the consequences if we told the people what happened here? They'd be devastated. If we can't trust the Guardians, who... died to preserve Bellaba. What? The visitors from beyond the sky told her the secret of the Stellaron. She knew that Alyssa Rand, the first Supreme Guardian, had failed to destroy it. And yet, she decided to challenge its power, a, a power beyond human comprehension. Supreme Guardian Kokolia sacrificed herself to dispel the dark from here on out. That's the truth the world will hear. What do you think? It keeps the hope of preservation alive. It's logical. And hard to- Why do we have to lie? I'm abstaining. I like telling the truth. But... Thank you for understanding. For many people, Mother was an outstanding guardian. Truth will live on in my mind. All the mistakes, madness, evil, dreams therein. Now, I must take over the duties of the Supreme Guardian. And discard. I'm sorry, Seal. Please, protect this secret with me. Say no more. I know what to do. Thank you. Well then. As promised, let's start rebuilding the bridge between the Overworld and the Underworld. Sila, can you tell everyone in the Underworld that the Stellaron has been sealed? And tell them the blockade will soon be over. And they will- Of course. Leave it to me. Nat's probably getting anxious. While you do that, I'll head back to the... administrative district. I need to tell Jabard. Are you okay? What's wrong, Branya? Do you feel... <sighs> I'm... I'm fine. Uh, she's exhausted. Quick, we need to think of some... Right. I almost forgot. You're still wanted by the guards. I'm... Let's settle then. I'll leave Nat to you. Remember... 
So, wanna tell us what happened back there? Don't think you can just reappear on... Uh, you drew the Amber Lord's gate? She probably doesn't know what happened either. This wouldn't be the first time. Something originally, we thought it was because the Stellaron was linked to the destruction. But now it seems to be more than that. Let's focus on the business at hand first. We shouldn't disrupt Himiko and Mr. Yang while they're dealing with this stuff. Mm, you're right. We need to finish what we started. You kids move fast. By the look on your faces, I assume- Mm-hmm. You bet. You might not- Uh, maybe she should do the talking. I'm no good at serious stuff. I'll probably say something I'll regret. The Supreme Guardian sacrificed herself to seal the Stellaron. We were there at the fight. Sacrificed herself, huh? Sure, yeah, that's the whole s- Kakolia. In order to save Bellabog, she... <sighs> so the massive tremors we felt earlier were a result of the battle, right? Thank you. <laughs> I can't even imagine what you've been through up there. I'm just glad everything turned out alright. What about Zila? Don't worry, she's all right. It took a big toll on Branya, so Zila took her over. Oh, good. I'm so glad you're all okay. Now that Kokolia's no more, I guess our Silvermane girl is about to become. She sees things through and doesn't go back on her word. The underworld will thrive again under her watch. Mm hmm. Oh, we brought you a message from Branya. <clears throat> The blockade will soon be lifted. The people of the underworld will breathe free- Breathe freely. <laughs> That's been our wish all along. March, Don Hung, and you. Can I ask for your help again? I want to get this news out to everyone. It'll lift their spirits and bring them hope. Thank you. Choose whoever you like. Wildfire will take care of the rest. We've gotten to know a lot of Underworlders. Who do you think we should start with? Hmm, roger that. You can leave the rest to us. If everything goes smoothly... <laughs> this should be Wildfire's final mission. Do you think the Gr- Take it. Oh, well, we actually... Hey, are you guys causing... It's you! 
Oh, no. There was a huge quake at the mine just now. Part of it collapsed. I was just discussing how to repay them. Oh. To do with us? Whoa. You mean to say... That Are you serious? The Today they do! If things go back to the way they were ten years ago, then you won't have to rely on the charity of- I... Thank you, outsiders, from the bottom of my heart. Please tell Natasha that we're ready to get back to work. If the cable cars... Yang put it nicely, but the reality is this. We sealed the Stellaron, but that's not gonna solve the problem. There I was getting excited to tell everyone the good news. That's the cruelty of a Stellaron. Still. So, should we tell everyone the deal? We should tell Branya when the time's right. Is everyone all right? <laughs> Sometimes face to now we just have to wait for the official news. Huh. Do you think Svarog and Clara felt- I think they'll be fine. Plus, Svarog's devotion to Clara is even greater than his hostility to wildfire. Outsiders. For friends of Clara. How did you know that was the the seems like Perkin Its language module must have malfunctioned. Outsiders are friends. Visitors, Clara. Oh, it's the variables. 
There was a huge shaking just now coming up through the ground. Mr. Svarag said it must have been... Recalculating. Conclusion. Engine of creation. 97.66%. The engine of creation was an immense construction machine created by the Ark. Well, whatever. We won. Thanks to that giant robot, we were finally able to take care of the Stellaron. Which means that you, Svarog, um, you won't have to worry about... March! Everyone! Thank you so much! I wasn't sure you guys would be able... But now... Mr. Svarog, what if you guys said you were travelers from other worlds, right? I want to be just like you. One day, I'm gonna go traveling to faraway places and make new friends. Calculation result. Update. Mission number zero zero. That's our Branya! Quick as a flash! <laughs> she certainly moves a lot faster than some people I know. If you haven't got anything nice to say... You were about to miss out. No way! After all our hard work, how could we miss out on the fun? <sighs> I don't know how much of a celebration. For Oleg and I, not to mention the other adults, but for the children who were born into this era, who grew up in. Once you've tasted freedom, it's difficult to accept a life of separation and isolation. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> Here I am, talking your ear off again. <sighs> if you have time, talk to the folks here. Every one of them will tell you about their excitement. Then when you're ready... Finally. Finally, I can get back to supervising the cable car. Ah, it's you! The liberators of the underworld! You're the first passengers we... Oh, uh... I'm afraid you might have to make an exception, miss. <clears throat> so, ready to climb aboard? Brothers, sisters, ladies, gentlemen, boys and girls of all ages. Whoa! <laughs> Look at the big... <laughs> that's not a ceiling, Hook. That's so this is... the overworld? <laughs> Less rust and geomero particles floating around. Take it. I never thought I'd live to see the administrative district again. <sighs> it's funny. The moment I boarded it now, I just want to sit down, zone out. Enjoy the peace and quiet, Natasha. We earned it. <laughs> it's Japard! Is he here to meet us? He's still on duty. Welcome back to the administrative district. Trailblazers! First time- <laughs> The architects think it's only right that we should address you properly. Uh, please allow me to apologize again for what happened in the restricted zone. You were only trying to help. I should have trusted Serval's judgment. Thanks for under- Lady Branya's inaugural address will begin soon. She asked me to pass- Uh-huh. 
That's sooner than I ex- Not really. But Lady Branya insisted on delivering the speech as soon as possible. The address will be held at Everwinter Monument. I hope the three of you can find time. over there. Is the address? Hmm. Looks like it. Guards! Formation! Whoa! This must be it! Citizens of Bellabog, I kindly ask for your attention. Lady... People of Bellabog, hear me! Today we gather here to celebrate our victory, but it was a sacrifice made by a mighty guardian that delivered us this opportunity. She dispelled an evil that cost us 700 years of suffering. The sacrifice of Kakulia Rand ushers in a new chapter. The blizzard beyond the walls will die away, and the offensives of our Silvermane guards will begin to contain the Fragmentum's advance. In the far north, I witnessed with my own eyes the struggle between the late Supreme Guardian and the evil power that sought to destroy us. In her last the order to seal off the underworld from the overworld. With the passage of time, she gradually came to realize the consequences of that decision. Although tortured with guilt, she could not in her final moments she wanted us to mark the Stellaron's end by reuniting Bellabog. Overworlders and Underworlders must embrace the dawn of a new age. People of the Underworld, I dare not ask for your forgiveness. I now know the reality of your decade of suffering. But I want us to work together we know that without your perseverance and hard work, Bellabog will not recover its former glory. And on that note, I'd like to extend my heartfelt gratitude to a few guests of the city. Most of you were not aware of their arrival, but it is thanks to them that our they made me realize that while we remain focused on preserving the ground beneath our feet, we should not forget to look up into the sky. I firmly believe that with the determination of everyone, our world, the world the Trailblazers call Yarilo Six, will no longer be alone among the stars. But before we accomplish that goal, I humbly ask you to follow me into the future. I, Branya Rand, the 19th Guardian of Bellabog, hereby take my oath. Branya, we're back. March, Don Hung, and you. It's wonderful you made it to the address. Sorry, I know the invitation was very last minute, but I needed to get the news out as soon as possible. The longer people waited, the more rumors started to swirl. Yes, I'm fine now, don't worry. My mother... She tried to force the voice of the Stellaron into my head. It was a terrible feeling. I don't know what would have happened if you hadn't shown up. That was some speech, Branya. If I had to talk like that in front of a huge crowd, I'd be shaking head to- It's all just a bunch of palatable lies. I hope you never have a similar experience, March.
for her to be honest with the people. But I also want to preserve their hope. Don Hung, wanna talk about Mr. Yang's findings? <laughs> Allow me to explain. Which means... The Fragmentum has already taken root by this point. Even though the Stellaron is sealed, we won't be able to reverse the damage immediately. I know. Our ancestors wouldn't have risked using one if they'd had other ways of avoiding calamity. You've gone out of your way to save this world. You nearly lost your life. I have no right to ask for more. Besides, I agree with Mr. Yang. Ultimately, the fate of Bellabog is in the hands of its own people. In that case, as a leader, I must give you a promise of the same. We will hold out with everything we have until the day you trailblazers return. Even if it takes another 700 years, the children of Yarilo Six will look up to the sky with hope in their hearts. So long, my friends. May the preservation bless your journey. Congrats! That was one heck of a first trail- Worth celebrating, I'd say. Five. Two and a half? What? That run of the mill, huh? My scoring criteria. Uh, anyway, we should be asking you. Wait, what? No way! We're about to leave and I've hardly got any. Come on! Let's go back to the administrative. said she's willing to wait 700 years for us. Huh. Here we are! Everyone- Oh! Kayla and Hook are here too! without wait that's a nice picture and wow photos are awesome <laughs> you like it it's yours okay where to next oh we haven't seen serval since we got back let's head to the workshop who's there <laughs> it's you three Come on in! How have you been, big sister? Miss Serval's workshop is amazing! There are all kinds of- Miss Serval? Clara is such a well-mannered kid. Meanwhile- Photo! <laughs> this feels like one of my fan me- Photo... Oh, I remember! Over here, Clara! Wanna learn some- Pretty great. I wish the photographer. Uh huh? Am I? Don't worry. If you eat like Don Hung. Uh. 
I'll... Here, keep it. A little farewell gift. Huh? You're le... I understand. Well, this photo will... The Thanks, Mr. Vault. Big Sister, March, Dan Hong. Thanks for taking care of me. If you have time, please come back and visit me and Mr. Svara. back to the Goethe Hotel. <sighs> Not so fast. Last time we were here, that evil Madame Guardi... Come on. Kimiko and... Besides, don't you want to chit-chat with the locals now that Bellabon... Come around and have a look. At the end of your journey, all that perplexes you and troubles you will resolve. Oh, it was a close thing, all right. Good thing it dawned on me. Hey, Sampo doesn't have to be a protagonist, right? <laughs> Turns out the Astral Express crew is more fun than I expected. <laughs> no, no. I'm in no hurry to leave. <laughs> uh, what? Oh, well, bye for now. Send my regards to the guys and girls in the tavern. Oh, and don't forget to say that Sampo Kaski will catch them for the next one. Time to make my... To you, my dear audience, I dedicate my performance. You don't have to answer that. But if the answer is no... We should be getting back to the Express. Time to find March and Dunhung. Did you get Himiko's message? It's time to go. <sighs> yeah, yeah. Well, pack your souvenirs. Last forever. Hey, I'm not that hard. Priorities? What do you mean? 
Are you saying rebuilding the underworld isn't one of your priorities? Of course not. I I'm just saying we have limited assets and we need new parameters. Assets, parameters. You sure love your fancy words. Ugh, forget it. Leave it to me. I'll go down myself. <gasps> Come on, Sila. I won't leave you to- Look, Branya! <sighs> There'll be plenty of difficulties waiting for them, right? Yes. Their future is filled with even more uncertainty than ours. But we will prevail here, even if it means arguments like this go on forever. <laughs> they won't go on forever if I win them. Welcome home, you three. Himeko! Mr. Yang! Team Trailblaze! Although Welt and I didn't get the chance to go with you, I can tell you worked hard to bring things back to normal. Well done, every- <laughs> I'd say it's a solid five stars. Get some rest on the Express. Urelo 6 was- Pom Pom is of the opinion that we should leave as soon as possible to avoid potential resurgences of the anomaly. Which means we need to decide where our next destination is. That's right. That's the path of the nameless, I presume. Always on the road, always trailblazing. Uh, I'm not complaining, by the way. One adventure after another? <laughs> Looks like Marge has fallen in love with- You can head back to your rooms for some rest. Or stay here and make yourselves a- I'll head back to my room then. <sighs> there I was thinking this guy would gradually open up. We need to give him some time, Marge. I think he treasures the time spent with you guys. About your battle against the Supreme Guardian and the whole Stellaron situation, you must have a lot of unanswered questions, I suppose. While you were away, Welt and I did some research and came to some interesting conclusions. Let me know if you want to ask about anything. Ah, home sweet home! Mr. Yang and Himeko must be bored given how long our train had to stay here. The express crew tread upon the trailblaze. We travel between worlds. The universe is vast beyond our imagination. It's a miracle that our paths converge. Thank you for becoming our companion. I'll do my best to answer any questions you may. It's virtually impossible to destroy a Stellaron. No one, not even her. when the Supreme Guardian was defeated, the Stellaron that had been transmitting, that's about all we can do about a Stellaron. But this brief window should allow the people on this planet. You're most welcome. Have some rest. So, your first trailblazing, be it joy or pain, success or regret, it's all part of the journey. Though it seems you have something on your mind. Let's hear it. I'm afraid not. As I've mentioned before, the Stellaron's influence on Urelo 6 is more provoked. The balance of power is tilting ever so slightly towards human. As intangible as it may sound, don't underestimate hope. Because the power it. Likewise, get some sleep. We'll be heading off again soon. Rail stability. Good to see you, Tip. Spatial readout. Star Rail stability keeps rising. The numbers have stabilized. Dispel. Welcome back to the Express. You've accomplished your trailblaze mission. Right away. To avoid encountering the anomalies again, the Express will dispatch for your safety. Please don't leave your seat until the Express. 